with a small force, okay, how about if I go a little more force, okay, so it'll tip. How about if I change the angle here? It's a little harder to, uh, at an angle it won't tip. Yeah, it seems like when you do the angle a little higher, it's harder to tip it, you know? So we want to do the physics of that. Now, how about if I make the string higher? Easier to tip or harder? Yeah, you don't apply any force and it tips, right? How about if you have the string less than the center of mass? How about if I do real fast? Yeah, this one, it kind of tries to tip the other way, right? Oh, this one. Yeah, it does a kind of a jerking motion like it goes this way, but since I'm dragging it, then it comes back and does that, right? But it's, if, you, if you're below the center of mass, it's likely to go this way, you know? But because you're still dragging it, it then it's going to do this. It's going gonna, it's gonna to go like that. So we're going to analyze the motion of that, the, the physics of that. So you want to, you know what, let's weigh the box first. Hundred and seventy four point one grams. Let's just round it, point one seven four kilogram. And then uh, let me determine its dimensions. I'll take the ruler here. There's some real good demos and stuff you could do here. Okay, now then we measure this. See, if we're going to drag it this way, this dimension doesn't matter probably, right? If, we're gonna, if I'm going to dra drag it this way, what matters is the width and the height, right? Not the depth. Okay, 14 centimeters, so roughly about 14. That's the, this, okay, and then what? I need the height, the height, right? 23 centimeters. So the first thing I would like to know is what is the mu k? What's the mu k? between this and the surface. How would I know that? What's the coefficient of kinetic friction? Well, I can drag it at a constant speed and measure the reading here. It's going to be very, right? Any, any constant speed will do here. For, okay, 0.4 Newtons. It takes 0.4 Newtons to drag it at constant speed. Yeah. So, so here's the force. So uh, if F equals 0.4 Newtons, it goes at constant speed. So the first thing, A, find the mu k. Find the mu k, okay? B, 
then I can ask uh, further questions. I can say, okay, if I have the string tied around, let's say the, uh, it needs to be more than the halfway mark, right? So the halfway mark is gonna be uh, 11 and a half, right? So I can make anywhere above the halfway mark. So if string is tied at a height of at a height of, uh, let's say, 15 centimeters, what is the, uh, what minimum force is it gonna tip? I can ask that question. Or the other way I can ask this is I can say, where should I tie the string so that if I exert the force of, let's say, two newtons, it tips? This is the other way of asking it, you know? So where should string be tied so that box tips for F equals two Newtons. I mean, they're kind of the same question, they're worded differently, you know. So uh, let's do part A. In this problem, I'm gonna do the force as if it's horizontal. It's a little easier to do that as a demo. I believe the book gives uh, this problem, but the book gives it at an angle. It tells uh, somebody's pulling a box at an angle and it tips over, you know. So uh, they just add a little bit of an angle to this. But I'll do it as a horizontal, it's a little easier to show. So uh, find mu k. So let's do part A. We've got the. Uh, mu k n, right? So if you're dragging it with a force of 0.4 and it's going at a constant speed, then that means uh, f equals a 0.4 must be equal to mu k n, right? And the n is equal to the mg, so because it's on a flat surface, you know, and then we can put the mass, uh, what was the mass? 0.174. So mu k is going to equal 0.4 divided by 0.174 times 9.8. So that's a one experimental way of calculating the mu k there. Can we probably point to something? Point two. Okay. So point two three five. This is approximate because I couldn't really read it that well, but so it's approximate answer. Okay, so then if the string is tied at the height of 15, what is F min to tip box? So what's gonna happen is this here. 